Hello, welcome back to another tutorial. I'm using 4mm beads as well as 2mm and 2.6mm beads. And I'm starting with the bigger ones. Also 50cm of 0.3mm nylon cord. It's simply adding a specific amount of beads on each side of your cord and then pass both ends through one big bead. Just follow along with me and the graphics on the side until our first heart is done. Connect the end by pulling the cord through the very first bead. Don't worry if your heart turns out wavy, it will straighten out later. When we have our second heart we can continue. I would hold them with the knots facing up, so when we fold it together they are hidden. Now we need more cord, I'm using 50cm and I'm using the 2mm beads. Let's begin by pulling our cord through the following beads. Add one bead and pull your cord through the other two beads. Now 
Now pass both ends of your cord through a new bead and pull your two hearts together. Now it should look like this. We continue by passing the cord through the next beads on each side. And adding a new bead. I repeat it one more time. Now we have to repeat those two steps for the rest of the heart. To this corner I would not add a new bead. Simply pull your cord through the next three beads like this. Now you can continue like before. At the end we have to pull the cord through the very first bead again. Now make a knot or two. Now the insides are connected, we have to repeat the same steps for the outside. Take a new piece of cord, mine's again 50 cm, and pass your cord through the two beads. Add one more and back through the beads on the other side. Then pull both ends of your cord through a new bead. I repeat it one more time. And repeat this for the rest of the heart. This time I would skip the corner on the bottom and pull your cord through all three beads. And again to end it I pass the cord through the very first bead. Now you can make a knot how you prefer. I seal mine with nail polish. And we are done. This is the finished heart. I hope you enjoyed this video and it was helpful. See you next time.